Joining me is Lloyd Cushenberry, the leader of this offensive line, and over 500 yards of offense. Again, we're kind of getting redundant saying that, but only on 48 plays. That's super impressive. And I wanted to ask you, you know, as the center and the leader of this offense, uh, you know, former Tiger great Todd McClure you know, put out there on social media that this might have been one of the best offensive line performances he's ever seen at LSU, and that's pretty impressive stuff. Yeah, it's definitely an honor that, you know, he, he said that. You know, he's a legend that we, look up, we all look up to. He's on our wall in our room. You know, that's our goal every 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 game. Just come out and set the tone early, keep nine clean, and let those receivers and backs make plays. There's been a lot made about some of the injuries on the offensive line, players out, now back in, kind of shuffling that lineup. It obviously was all working tonight. You kept Joe clean. You rushed the ball really well. Did it feel different tonight? It definitely did. Uh, we, were, we were a motivated group tonight uh, after last year, and I, I tried to you know make that clear that we couldn't, ha couldn't let that happen again. So we were motivated all week to come to work, and it all, it all came together tonight. A lot made about that Florida defense all week, right? It was the Florida defense, LSU offense. Uh, obviously, you guys won the battle, but when you watched film and you were preparing for this ball game, did you have an inkling that you guys were going to move the ball as much as you did? Definitely. Uh, you know, they're a strong defense, but, you know, everybody has their weaknesses. And we, we saw things that we could attack, and Coach did a great job making a great game plan, and we executed tonight. I gotta ask you, from an offensive line standpoint, you got a choice. Here's your choice: I can, my quarterback can either throw for over 300 yards, or I got a back that goes for over 100 on the ground. Which would you prefer? Hey, if we can get both. That'd be a, <laughs> well, a great a, night. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. uh, and we, our goal in the run game is 250 yards, and and our main goal in protection is just keeping keeping Joe clean and letting him make plays, and which we we all seen he can do that. So everything came together tonight. It was a great win. One last thing, we talked to Clyde earlier. You know, everybody talks about the next great batch of backs. They talk about the receivers. They talk about Joe, talk about you in the line. He kind of gets lost in the shuffle. But all you do is it looks up, and he's gaining five, six yards a carry. Every, every game, every day, you know, he's a workhorse. He comes to work every day, doesn't say much, he just works. And from day one since he's been here, every day he just worked and just tried to get better every day. And he's a great leader in that room, and guys look up to him. No, great job by you and your, and your offensive line. We'll see you next week in Starkville. All right, let's go back to Victor in the studio.